G'day guys, are you up for a challenge? In this video, I'm gonna show you how you can customize your Killers Cobra bag to make it insanely fast. Now the way that you can increase the speed of the Cobra bag is by modifying the top click bar, i.e. reducing it, reducing it in size, and that's gonna increase the speed. And there's two ways that you can do this. The standard click bar is 15 inches in length. And one way to do this is to actually cut it with a jigsaw or a grinder. So the shortest you want to go is 12 inches. You don't want to go any shorter than that. And you will need to drill the holes for the push buttons to reposition them. The other way is to get a 3 quarter inch PVC pipe and to cut off a section that is 12 inches in length. Now make sure you get the right diameter pipe. It's 1.05 or 1.06 inches in diameter. Just take your adapter with you to make sure that the pipe that you buy actually fits. And here it is guys, simply taped to the top connector of the KS3 spring and the bottom of the ball adapter. So the top section is now smaller and that should make an increase in the speed. Let's see. Whoa, that's actually quite a substantial increase in speed. So if you do want speed increase, this is how you do it. Now I'm gonna show you how to install these eight mil push buttons that you can get on cures.com into the PVC pipe effectively so you can have length adjustment. Now the first thing you wanna do is take your foot long or so PVC pipe and insert it into the adapter all the way in and just tape it temporarily. Just so it stays there while you mark the top hole. So mark it on one side and then mark it on the opposite side. And once you've drilled out your eight mil holes on both sides, just double check them with the push button to make sure that it's not getting stuck and it can go in nice and easy. And then push it in till it springs into place and Bob's your uncle. Now just insert it into the adapter so that this push button goes all the way to the last hole and insert it into the spring connector all the way until it's flush. And then just line it up with all the buttons lined up like this and mark the bottom where the bottom hole is. Just mark it there. That's where you're gonna drill it. Come around the back and mark the back hole, making sure that it doesn't move while you're marking it. And here it is guys. This is the shortest version of the click bar that you'd ever want to have. You don't want to go any shorter than this. This is 12 inches or a foot long and 3 inches from each end to the push buttons. Put it into the bottom hole and then put your um, ball all the way down. So you can see it sits flush with the spring connector. So that is the shortest. and this will give you the fastest speed, being that's your shortest that's, that it could possibly go. It's quite fast. Now you can see it's protruding a little bit in the spring. That doesn't really matter. I'm going to paint it black and make it look like it's part of the kit. Now to paint it, I'm actually going to take out the spring buttons. To take out spring buttons from these um, pipes, you just push the buttons in. Use needle nose pliers and they come out. Now I've actually painted it a red color just so I can distinguish it from all my other click bars that are all black. It's time to put some gloves on. Woo! It is super fast. I mean, I've tested some fast Cobra bags but this is insane. Now one thing I should mention is that by making the top section shorter, the height of your Cobra bag is gonna come down a little bit. And if you're tall like me, six foot or above, you may consider making a taller baseboard, which I've shown in my previous video and I'll put in the description. So go ahead and check it out. 